Black History Month is an annual celebration of achievements by African Americans in U.S. history. The observance began when scholar and historian Carter G. Woodson believed the contributions of Black Americans were largely overlooked. What began as a week-long celebration in 1926 grew to a month-long event officially recognized in 1976. For us in the ELCA, this is also a time to recognize the achievements of Black Lutherans and their role across this church. ELCA African Descent Ministries is celebrating Black History Month with season two of Talks at the Desk, a video series that explores diverse expressions of the church and honors the future, present, and past of Black Lutherans. New episodes premiere on the ELCA's YouTube page every Wednesday in February at 7.30 p.m. Central Time. This year, we especially remember the life and witness of the late Reverend Dr. Richard Stewart, who documented the legacy of Black Lutheranism in the U.S. context. Dr. Stewart, a pastor and associate professor emeritus at United Lutheran Seminary, was one of the foremost students and researchers of African American history. At the time of his death last November, Dr. Stewart was doing extensive research on the history of contributions of Africans and African descent Americans to Lutheran traditions. He conducted interviews with Lutheran leaders of African descent who described the challenges and the opportunities of contributing to Lutheran traditions. Dr. Stewart shared some of his findings with Living Lutheran, and I encourage you to explore this work. A group of scholars have committed to completing the work Dr. Stewart started. We celebrate his prolific contributions and we give thanks that his legacy continues. This is our Black history. Let us pray. Gracious God, we give thanks for the gifts, accomplishments, influence, and witnesses of our African descent neighbors and siblings in Christ. May we glorify you as partners in the gospel, doing your work in the world together. Guide our church in its pursuit of racial justice, socioeconomic equity, and racial reconciliation. We pray in the name of the one who has made us one, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Be well, dear church.